I think fundamentally the main issue is, is in relation to compliance with the D2 discharge standard and the need for the provision of type approved ballast water treatment plant which provides additional regulatory requirements that put pressure on both space within the vessel and also power requirements and the associated uh, demand on the power generation plant. I think that we within the REG have built up a great deal of expertise regarding the regulatory requirements and the implementation of the convention and that is something that we are able to share with our clients and uh, ultimately provide them with assistance to ensure that they fully comply with the requirements of the convention.